Back to games with nibbles. We're playing Batman the Telltale series. And this time it's gonna be episode two. Check my playthrough of episode one in the previous video on my YouTube channel. Just go to YouTube and type in the nibbler or if you want to be mega precise, DA underscore nibbler N I double B L E R. And here we go. This is gonna be good. Dun 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 dun. A revolution is knocking on Gotham's door. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. Yeah. That's apparently supposed to be the cobblepot Mr. guy, Wayne. which is weird. Thank you for opening your house to us. I didn't know that they Together, were friends. We will change Gotham. Oh, I have a viewer. Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to Haven't know Haven't even you. booted up my YouTube channel. Not interested. <laughs> no one ever watches. for the Gotham Gazette. Carmine Falcone? Vicky Vale. Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Your father knew which hands to shake. Don't you know not to corner a wild animal? It's dangerous. Hello, cat woman. And yes, Batman hit a girl. To be fair, she scratched him. <laughs> this is Selena. Hi, Selena. How many? I'd have to count the pieces. Falcone's calling card. Hmm, that's the weird. Chemicals. Where are they? We're all being played in, couldn't you? <laughs> it's the Waynes. <laughs> well, the Waynes are the biggest gangsters in Gotham. Oh no. I know that someone just put a comment, but I can't see it on the YouTube thing, so I'm not sure what's going on. Hang on, guys. Oh, Jira, it's you again. Are you watching on YouTube? Or are you, are you watching in some other way, shape, or form? I have no idea how this works. I'm broadcasting on YouTube, but I don't know whether you could potentially watch it somewhere else. Because I quite like to interact with people while I play. Um, but I can't see your comment on the chat on YouTube at all, so I'm not sure if I'm looking at the right thing. Also, it says my stream's offline, so I'm not sure I'm looking at the right thing. I had this problem last time. <laughs> Alfred. Ah, now I can see it. Yeah, baby, here we go. I thought I might find you here. I'm technologically challenged. The news was upsetting for both of us. But you should see this. Okay. I know you come here for solitude, Bruce. More allegations about his ties to the underworld. This isn't going away. It's all so public and messy. Tell me. All of this is a lie. I wish I could. There are no angels in Gotham, Bruce. Maybe there never were. How sad. I've been dreading this day for nearly two decades. So you hid it from me for two decades, I it would douche. Never come. Forget the papers. I want to hear it from you. The truth is, they were billionaires, Bruce. You can't amass that kind of wealth without making certain moral compromises. Uh -huh. It's just not possible. Uh -huh. That kind of money taints you. My money has never corrupted me, and I'm proud of you. But you're hardly the norm. 
Plus, you already had a lot of billion billions to start with. Bill greased the wheels of politics. Falcone was the muscle. Thomas legitimized the whole enterprise with his name. Your father, Hamilton Hill, and Falcone, they were partners. And I just pissed off Falcone in the nothing last episode. Oh, awesome. them knowing. Falcone, the papers, they were telling the truth. Everyone and I gave a shit comment. This, but no. me. I know it's a lot to take in. I want you to know I had my suitcases ready. I could not stand to be around your father anymore. <gasps> Did you kill him? Were you responsible? Were you involved? Were killed. And you were all alone. Alfred? I couldn't walk out the door. What are you not everything telling I me? Did, everything I've ever done was out of love for you. I hope you can forgive me. Oh, we're still family, dude. You? You're all I've got, Alfred. Thank you. I won't let you down. Just again. don't do it again. You broke this is my the heart, first old time man. I've been back here since that night. When the police called me to collect you, I thought they'd finally arrested your father. Aww. I couldn't believe a low-life thug like Joe Chill would have the audacity to rob and kill Thomas Wayne. Yeah, but you always think that's not going to happen, and then it happens. Too, too big. Yet, there it was. If my father was that deep in crime, he would have had enemies. Well, that's a fair assumption. You don't think? You always said it was a simple mugging. In 20 years, you've Simple. never uh -huh. wavered from that story. I can recall every moment of that night in vivid detail. Detail. But maybe detail. that's wrong. Detail. Sometimes we block out things we don't want to face. Please do maybe not go to a hypnotherapist. I <gasps> He's doing detective stuff again. Is he? Is he? Yeah, he is. Okay. Okay. Oh. It's really weird, like, it's, it's not really high on processing power, but every now and then it just goes... Uh, 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 uh. Oh, you can't really do that. You know what I mean. Right now. And what would the Batman do with his own parents' killer? Kill him? The possibilities are frightening. I wouldn't trust myself around him. Yeah, Batman I'd kill him. doesn't kill. Yeah, but Bruce That's Wayne does. I wouldn't trust myself. He was stabbed to death in prison. No one mourns for Joe Chill, Bruce. See, I really liked it when it was the version where um, it was the Joker. Was that in the in in the Burton one? I think where Joker was actually responsible for killing his parents. He just wanted to protect us. He thought he was invincible. Sadly, he was mistaken. I just. I can't picture him as a criminal, not the kind I deal with. In that moment... Yeah, thanks, Jerry. I figured it out. <laughs> Thank you for watching and saying hi. Um, is there something in the back? Oh, there's... what's... the theater. The theater? But they went to the movies, right? That's what he said in the last episode. I love that movie. I saw it countless times at that theater. How long did it play there? Only when you wanted to see it, Bruce. Your mother arranged the special screenings personally. Wow. I never knew that. <laughs> Must be nice so being good. rich. Where exactly does the memory end? With my father pleading. You don't have to do this. And the gun fires. And after that? Uh, there are considerable gaps in that recollection. Yes, there are. Maybe. Do I really want to know? Yeah, we want to know. We want to know. We need to figure this out now. Uh, where are we moving to? 
Having a eidetic memory. He's just like, okay, let's just think back to this. And here we go. And we immediately trust whatever I think of not taking into consideration that what happened in the previous episode might have influenced what we now think is our proper recollection of events from what, 30 years ago? Yeah, we immediately trusted us, like, yes, this is what it was. Charming. Getting you in to see Falcone like this? I don't have to tell you how many rules we're breaking. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm always here for you, but this could land us both in hot water. I pulled all the strings I had with the lieutenant. This better not come back to bite us. Look, I get that hard, okay? And it means a lot to me. I know it does, Bruce. It doesn't make it any easier. I wonder if we get to see him the turn into Two Face. Behind closed doors with Falcone, the press made us pay. Yeah, well, there were things I didn't At know that I now know. This is about. No, it's, it's personal. Look, I'm all for blind support. This is a personal matter, Harvey. Very Fine. personal. Fine. Don't tell me. I hope none of this comes back to bite us. I don't want headlines taking away from my debate with Hill. Gentlemen. The we tenant? finally put Falcone in his cage. Now, well, thanks to the information you gave me, Bruce, he won't ever get out. Whoa, I'm sorry. Uh, information? What information? Oh. Well, I assumed you knew. I was going to contact your office first thing. I gave him some evidence against Falcone. Uh, more like a catalog of his entire criminal empire. It's a case that'll put Falcone away for life. Is that a fact? It's the reason I said yes to this unorthodox request. Hmm. Unorthodox is my middle name. Nice job bringing in Falcone. Yeah, that son of a bitch better not get off again. He's not getting off the hook, Rene. Not this time. Mr. Wayne, Sergeant Rene Montoya. I just wanted to say, you know, some of us police support you, despite what the media is saying. Thanks, Sergeant. Oh, thanks. Because he's Falcone good looking, in the rich, or both? He's lucky he didn't get roughed up more. I could tell Batman wanted to kill him, but he held back. He cares about doing the right thing. Well, whoever he is behind that mask, I say Gotham's lucky to have him. Yeah, it's great to know he's out there watching over the city. Exactly, people. Come on, show some appreciation right, for the work. Inside. You say what you got to say. We'll be out here. <clears throat> okay, okay, let's do this. What are we gonna say? I know what happened. Episode two. Yeah, I agree, Jerry. I also don't understand this whole Batman doesn't kill thing. 
Just because he doesn't use lethal means Bruce doesn't mean Wayne. the outcome isn't lethal. You must have some clout. My own wife can't get in to see me. Wow, the dude doesn't even have a Good blanket. Thing I'll be out of here in a week. <laughs> we need to talk, Falcone. You weren't so eager the last time we met. But then, I knew you'd come around. Especially after the press got their teeth in you. <laughs> You're your father's son. Yeah, that's right. Tommy and I were close. More than friends. More like cousins. Until you sent Joe Chill to kill him. Unchill. Ah, so that's dun, dun, what this dun. is really about, eh? The pop digging up a 20-year-old killer. Two killings. And they were never forgotten. You and me, we're practically family. I thought you'd have figured that out by now. Hey, I tried to get through to your dense party. Maybe I should have spelled it out. Got a whole closet full of birthday presents I was never able to give you. Convince me then. Tell me a story about our big, happy family. <laughs> hmm. There it is. Now I got you hooked. Your father, Hill, and me. We ran this city. Still do. <clears throat> God damn this pain. Can't think through it. Tough More shit. on the side there. Be a good boy and help Uncle Carmine out, huh? No, you be a good uncle and just fucking talk. I cannot hear to take care of you. You deserve to suffer. Yeah, the Dark Knight is dark. Very dark. You'd never know the truth. Bruce, that will set off alarms. Do you hear the machine? What are you doing? I need you alive. But only until I have answers. Apple didn't fall far, did it? You got that Wayne seed. He loved you, you know. He did it all for you. He protected his own. If you got on his bad side. Your father was more ruthless than any of us. He had a switch, you know. Still, made us all rich, including you. Some people just have the mind for it. I never asked for any of it. And yet, the money spends, doesn't it? He made you rich, but you still had him killed. <laughs> what, you really think I ordered the hit? Sure, I worked with Joe Chill from time to time. Put a button on someone, he'd take him out. But I never ordered that hit on your parents. Really? So who did? You can't trust anyone in Gotham. Least of all those you call friend. Your parents learned that. <gasps> Unexpected. They're waiting for you in hell! The bastard had to die. Who'd he kill for you? Hit She's you. poisoned. Stand down! Get a doctor! Secure this floor! No one gets in or out! Go! Yeah, he's not Go. coming back from the headshot, is he? We did not get answers. God damn it! <laughs> that bodes well. <laughs> Turn the camera off. We are uh. deep shit. I bought us some time, but not much. Or it's gonna get out sooner or later. Why would she do something like this? Why don't you ask her? Gotham's biggest crime lord in our grasp. I don't, I don't know. I hardly recognized her when she burst in. She was so different from the woman we met in the hall. It's a disgrace. A 
another officer gone rogue. Oh, it's uh, that stuff, the toxin that was in the barrels in the last episode. She never do anything to hurt the department. Oh, Falcone's case meant justice for a thousand unnamed victims. And now it is a PR disaster. How can I run against corruption when our own cops are redecorating the precinct with their prisoners' brains? Mm. Listen, we gotta get out in front of this. Judge Dredd style. as best we can. Issue a statement saying that we have the shooter in custody. Slow down, Harvey. We need the facts first. The simple fact is she walked in and shot him. Facts, Max. Then we need the complex mm. facts, like how and why. Lieutenant, uh, Mr. District Attorney, uh, Falcone's lawyers are here. Well, they can't talk to him now. I can delay them for a little while, but we still need answers. He's uh, slightly indisposed. Tell me if she says anything. He's sleeping it off. I have to know why she did this. <laughs> He's in between brains. <sighs> Alfred, Falcone's been murdered. Good God. Good God, Graves. Oh I'm looking God. into it, but I'll need access to the back computer for anything I find. Connection secured. Alfred, I'm gonna try and confirm some suspicions of mine. Some weird shit on her throat. She's under the influence of crap. Her veins still visible beneath her skin. A fresh injection site. Mm, that doesn't look like blood. Alfred, I think I found the substance. Analyze and forward me the result. Mm -hmm. Of course. I'll be in touch as soon as I have the results. Wakey, wakey. Where am I? Mr. Wayne? What I'm the cop here. On? What the fuck? Well... Oh, but I got this awful feeling something terrible happened. Sergeant, you have to think. What do you remember? Oh, God. Falcone. I was hoping it wasn't real. I believe you were drugged, Sergeant. I... It would explain a lot. Listen, you have to believe me. I talk big about hurting thugs like Falcone. But I would never, never betray the lieutenant. Everything is so foggy. I remember a sharp pain. There's an injection site on your neck. Then it just felt light. Like I could do whatever I wanted. No guilt, no consequence. Awesome. There was a voice in my ear insisting Falcone was going to get off. And all I knew was that I had to stop that. I had to, no matter what. The reasons why I shouldn't. They were a million miles away. D did you see a face? Could you ID a suspect? I, Why are you I interrogating so. me, Mr. Wayne? You're you not a police officer. Try. Just some rich playboy. I a hand on my arm. But that's all right. Me, like a parent with a child. The voice. It was saying the something voice, about not the voice. revolution. Cobblepot mm -hmm. said something similar. Exactly. And there was the psychedelic thingy-majig. I'm so sorry, Lieutenant. Good morning, I'm Sergeant. Down. We stalled Falcone's lawyers for now, but they'll be back. How is she? Did she tell you anything? Yeah, hey, hey, don't worry about that now. I found evidence that she was drugged. A fresh injection site on her neck. I was out of my mind, Lieutenant. Please believe me. Hey, I do. Of course I do. Hey! Get forensics in here. Now! She remembers a voice saying something about revolution. That's not much to go on. Now, if you're bringing forensics in, let's get Bruce out. Alfred, I gotta get back to the manor. I've got a lead on whoever's behind this. Bruce! Why is your finger in your ears not conspicuous at all? Wh what are you doing here? My friends in the, in the GCPD have been telling stories... About some kind of lockdown? The press can't seem to leave me alone. 
Yeah, well, I don't know what to tell you. Maybe it's your cologne. Word is there were shots fired near where Falcone was being held. Know anything about that? I mean, you must have been back there when it happened. I have no comment at this time. Don't be like that, Bruce. Talk to me. Word is you turned over enough dirt on Falcone to put him in Blackgate prison for life. A day after he showed up at your house. And now you're here. You can't afford to be associated with another scandal. I can't afford I can to talk to you. I can keep whatever we print, but you need to give me something I can use. Who fired the shots? A, a cop? I can tell by the way you're brushing me off that something happened. Please, get out of my way, Vicky. I'm in a hurry. Huh. Disappointing. Maybe you have more to do with this than I thought. We don't like you anymore, Vicky. Did we ever like her? Oh, I think we liked her when we were introduced. And then we stopped liking her pretty quickly after that. Yum! Back that car is so cool, before it turns into a Batmobile. Either Cobblepot drug Montoya himself, or someone else is using his revolutionary rhetoric. Either way, I need to find him. Let's put our drones in the air and start a search. I'll run a trace on his cell. In the meantime, we have to find out what we can do about this Never. Mel Montoya. Wow. Similar to the nerve agent I found at the docks. Let's see what we got. It's ironic that Falcone died at the hands of someone drugged with his chemicals. Ah, the Who irony. guessed that's how he'd meet his maker? Prone in his sick bed, surrounded by police who were ordered to protect him. Falcone got off easy by getting killed. He deserved much worse. Whoever did this was judge, jury, and executioner. No one should act as all three. Except for Judge Stroke. he told you something before he was killed. What did you learn from him? Let's just focus on the task at hand. Fair enough, Master Bruce. But if yeah. you learned something about your parents' murder, I deserve to know. What, you kept shit from me for 20 years? Yeah, well, I suppose that makes sense. Oh, does it now? Your father, Hill, and Falcone would have balanced each other out. Computers pinpointed reference points on the two compounds. The Oops, minute the dogs days. were doused with the base chemicals, the reaction was messy. Hmm. They were out of control. Just a tiny bit. See, for reference, first episode. This refined drug is like a weapon. It only took a small injection to strip Montoya of her moral filters and make her act on her base impulses. Yeah, pretty brilliant, actually, if you want that kind of a thing. Both compounds seem stable, but they're quick to fall apart. Whoever processed it knew what they were doing. What could the creators of such a drug possibly have in mind? Fighting your wars Anarchy? is one thing, but drugging others to fight them for you? Oh. With this drug, they can exploit anyone's baser impulses, the things they would otherwise control. Your drones are in position to triangulate Cobblepot's location. Drones. Select a drone to search. Okay. Press X when you find a portion. How do I know? Hello, hello. Is it is it gonna is something gonna happen?
me her head! Whose head? Good for now, we're good for now. Where else would it be? The Skyline Club. Everything's at the fucking Jesus, Skyline Club. Didn't even wait for Falcone's body to get cold, did you, Oz? Going to speak with him, Bruce? Bruce no. Wayne already tried talking with Cobblepot. It's time he met the Batman. Batman, me Penguin. Penguin, me Batman. Batman. It's weird to doubt like childhood friends. I mean, I'm not a comic book person, but I've never picked up on any of that in any of the films and stuff. So when that happened in the first episode, I was like, wait, what? Okay, I'm gonna go and see the Batman. There he is. And he doesn't have this weird walk that the dude has in the Gotham TV series. I kind of like that walk. Oh, nothing happens when I point two fingers at shit. Conspicuous. So quiet. You lot, come check out this office. Or you lot, come check out this office. Where is? You can help me. Hello. No longer inconspicuous. Let him go. Hello, people. Penguin. You kill a crime boss, you'd expect a word of thanks from Gotham's number one vigilante. Don't That's worry, why I'm I'll here. Pass gratitude on to those who made it happen. They'll be pleased to know you think so highly of their work. I said let him go. You hear that, Rowling? That sounded like an order. I'll crush him. Now, now, have Are a little crusher. respect for the bat. Think he underestimates you. Is this about Falcone? We all what happened saw to the boys? About Falcone, pounded him into a pulp on live TV. Well, if should you were truly the defender of this city, you'd have finished the job yourself. Admit it, Falcone deserved to die. Vermin like Falcone, they deserve to be stomped out. You don't decide who lives and who dies. That's not justice. Vice justice. Vice that is fine, isn't it? As a show of good faith, I'm gonna let this one go. How's about we talk this through? We helped you with Falcone. Now, if we could just cut out the rest of the rot, like Wayne and Hill, ordinary folks might be able to breathe. Oswald Cobblepot. What is it about this place that attracts Oswald criminal scum like you? Gotta admit, you've got flair. Here's the thing. I actually admire you, Batman. We both want the same kinds of things. Me and my people, we've got big plans for Gotham. They found Catwoman. Uh -oh. What do you want with her? We had a deal. She didn't make good on it. So sorry this didn't work out, mate. I'd stay and watch. I would, but I still got a Catwoman problem to deal with. Oh, what's her name again? Selena. Yes! Oh, beautiful name! <laughs> Curio. <laughs> oh, I pressed the button, but... Oh. Oh my god! <laughs> I just got Batman killed. <laughs> I was like, I pressed the button, why is nothing happening? <laughs> Why is he so strong? Yeah. 
Just go somewhere. In the face. Oh. Gonna have to try harder than this. Clearly, let's use a concrete block. Grab load, cut worm, grab load, grab load. And gravel stuff. That was close. Kapow. Where did you go? Let's smash into store. Everybody's gone, bugger. Alfred, track down Selena Kyle. I'll find her right away. And not for a coffee date, for a I need to save her life date. Let's save her life, quick! Loading times, oh my god, she could be dying right now! No capes. <laughs> no claws. No capes, no claws. Well, he's wearing a hoodie, so she can wear, like, a tiny little claw. I know it's not a cape, but still. Yeah, let's play pool. Yeah, this woman's got taste. Love it. What's with the face? It's a bar, I want a beer. Are you here? You lost? Because I don't have time for tourists. Looks like you walked into the wrong bar. You know Selena Kyle, there are men after her. Uh-huh, when aren't there? Well, these ones are trying to kill her. Hey, don't I know you? It is you. Knew it. Cops take all your fancy clothes? <laughs> Are you trying to lay low? Of course, you're not really the low-lying type. Uh, buy you a drink? How about a few? <laughs> it ain't like you're short on cash. Leave him alone, Frank. Man's just trying to have a quiet drink. He didn't seem to mind the company. But whatever. Hi, Selena. Selena, I need to tell you something important. Better be an apology. You were supposed to take care of our mutual problem. Well... Instead, you just pissed him off. That's why I'm here. You're in danger. I've had rats on my tail all day. The man who hired you. His name is Oswald Cobblepot. Never heard of him. <laughs> he goes by Penguin. Penguin? Shit. Ugh, you've got to be kidding me. You should have just killed me on that rooftop. I'm dead anyway. When you screw someone over, you really screw them. The penguin. <laughs> penguin can't take on both of us, and I'm not going anywhere. Clearly you know something about him. I only know him by reputation. Stronger He's together. <laughs> He's a big deal across the pond. He's more dangerous than you think. You don't know what you're getting into. I can take him. I appreciate confidence in a man, but not stupidity. The question is, why Gotham? Why now? It's not like he's hurting for crime syndicates abroad. He thinks he's changing the world for the better, no matter the cost. Well, he's no Joan of Arc, that's for sure. Well, I'm not sticking around here to find out. Oswald, Penguin is about to unleash God knows what on the city. You can't just leave. A good reason not to be here when he does. You want to stay? That's your choice. Whatever Penguin is planning, innocent people will end up in the line of fire. Innocence. 
Not me. Bruce. Sweetie. The gallant knight. Sweetie. Man. It really is adorable. But what would Harvey think? The two of us working together? After all, I'm not really an all work and no play kind of girl. Harvey knows that. I'm sorry, why are, why are we talking about Harvey? He's your friend, isn't he? Just seeing how much of a conscience you really have. You and I... Uh-oh. This can only be trouble. Well, Bruce. You were right. Selena Kyle? Penguin says, hello. Hello. Beat it. We're here for her. If you care about your own skin? She's with me. I think you need to leave. Here we go, bitches. It's on. Oh, Bruce Wayne's a ninja. Nobody knew. Maybe they didn't bring guns. Kiss him? Dude. That thing doesn't move very quickly. It doesn't give you a lot of choice Not to go to a left or right, left or right. Mm. You better pay for the damage to lose that poor lady. Her bar is totally smashed. Look at those two teaming up. Awesome! I think they want more. Then let's give it to them. <laughs> now he's got two, man. to read <laughs> you fight pretty good for such a pretty boy you're not shabby either you should probably go because you're Bruce Wayne and then it's like what are you doing here why are you a ninja kid come on this way Let's get out of the alleyway. Negative. Let's check the other side. Check the other alleyway. We're so good at checking things, guys. Are we alone? Well. Yeah, we're, we're alone. Let's get out of here. <laughs> But we had a moment. Take the rooftops. You take the alley. Wait. Just stay out of trouble. <laughs> now, where's the fun in that? 
You shouldn't trust me, you know. Alfred, I'm uploading the contents of a smartphone to the back computer. Check to see if there's anything on the phone we can use. Sure thing. Uh, processing it now. Is everything all right? There are quite a few police cars convening on your location. Yeah, it's well. Has the back computer found anything yet? Bruce, there are a number of messages here. All from Mayor Hill. Mayor Hill? Uh, the last voicemail is his. Listen to this. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Hmm. This is very shady indeed. Whatever they're talking about, it doesn't sound good. I should have guessed. What else is on there? Looks like they were in contact many times. If Hill's talking to Penguin, he must know something. It's time I paid him a visit. I agree. The mayor must have answers, but if I may offer a word of advice... People look up to Batman after how you handled Falcone. Terrorizing the mayor could damage that goodwill. Then again, Batman's methods would certainly get him talking immediately. Mm. Bruce would have to depend on his guile to loosen mm. Hill's lips. Oh, we're going as Batman. Yeah, I agree, Jerry. Um, going as Batman is the sure bet. The Fable Telltale stuff, the, the Wolf Among Us, I think it was. That's one of the... That's way better. Yeah, that's definitely uh, a great one. I think after, that was the second one after I did The Walking Dead. Um, and I love The Walking Dead. But The Wolf Among Us was amazing. And then my favorite is Tales from the Borderlands because the narrative structure is just ridiculously entertaining. And it's so much fun. But yeah, the Batman one is all right. It's, so far, it's not winning me over yet. But it's better than the Minecraft one. I've only played episode one of the Minecraft one and I'm just not liking that one at all. Batman has the public trust after taking down Falcone. Try not to throw it away by going overboard on Hill. Don't worry, Alfred. I'm a light touch. When I need to be. When the I city need will to thank be. Me later, if Hill tells me Penguin's plans. Yeah, Selena and Batman just killed yeah, a few people. Dents up in the polls. I need to crucify him in the debate, or we can kiss re-election. That's what I mean. Is it just because he doesn't shoot You're anyone doesn't mean he doesn't kill anyone. Deborah, is that you? You know who I am. It's time to work. Great. Oh! You know who I am. Batman? What are you doing here? You know who Penguin is. So I've heard of him. So what? I've got nothing to do with that lowlife. Do you hear me? You think people will still vote for you when you've got no teeth left? I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Wayne, there's the real problem. He's the one you should be after. Every fiber of his being built on lies, his status, his fortune. You really believe that? I witnessed firsthand the atrocities of his family, and he's the one who profited. <gasps> You're running away, Stop doofus. Pick up, goddammit! Security! Oh. Don't kill me! I've done nothing wrong! Why come to you? Because I knew about Arkham Asylum and what was done to those poor people. Penguin wants revenge for what happened to his mother. Thomas Wayne sent her to Arkham, along with who knows how many other innocents. Nothing was wrong with any of them. Something this big couldn't have been hidden. There'd be records. <sighs> with enough money, you can make anything or anyone disappear. <gasps> mm. I didn't dare speak up. Whatever happened in the past, it's nothing compared to what's happening now. Penguin isn't the only child of Ark. There are others whose families were destroyed by Wayne. 
They'll make Gotham pay for his sins. Great. <gasps> no. Please. Don't. <sighs> you can tell your story to the police. See what they think about it. If I hadn't given Penguin what he wanted, he would have struck the debate tonight. I didn't just do this for myself. I'm trying to protect Gotham. Finally. About damn time. It's Batman! Shoot him! Come on, get Why would you here. shoot me? I heard everything, Master Bruce. What he said about your father. It must be difficult to process. I need to know what went on in Arkham Asylum. Indeed. I'm just as frustrated as you are. Hill seems to think he's safe, but Penguin's still out there. Come on, what's next? What's next? Let's go to Arkham. <laughs> Screech. See, I like it better when it's red. I wonder what else is on here. Put it in and find out. As per your request, Lieutenant Gordon has tripled security at the debate. Thanks, Alfred. But... Gordon heard about Batman's surprise visit to the mayor. He was far from happy. Thanks for the help. Well... Sir. Tough shit. It's a plan of the old Monarch Theatre. The auditorium where the debate's being held. Hmm. Hmm. I hacked into the image feeds from the security cameras at the auditorium. Just to be safe. Just to be safe. No, I didn't read the Fables comics. There's a Jones, lot of them and that always intimidates me. It must have been quite upsetting. But I love the can't game and I can't wait for season feel. two. To learn so much in so little time. To hear their crimes detailed. First by Falcone, then by a snake like Hill. It makes me question Nick. myself. You shouldn't, Bruce. Mm. You are your own man. And the city needs you, now more than ever. Uh, I'll uh, leave you yeah. to it, then. Leave me to it. Let me do my stuff. Gotta get ready. Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent appears to be hitting some potholes on his path to the mayor's office. Despite the backing of billionaire Bruce Wayne, rumors persist that the candidate is having mm. trouble paying his campaign staff and his <laughs> Oh, excuse me. person said these rumors are nothing mm. more than a smear tactic for pe Wait a minute. The images oh. on these cameras haven't changed. Something's oh, wrong. it's frozen. Penguin. Something's that happening. The cameras on their end. I thought you were leaving me to it, Alfred. What, what the heck? To see. Warn Gordon that he may have visitors. I have to get down there. Now. Now. Up and away, Batman. That doesn't work, does it? No, no, it doesn't. All right, so we looked at the camera feed and then we're like, oh, we have to go again. Get in, get out. Harvey and needs see to what get happens. Out Phone ring, Harvey. Hey, Bruce. Man, I'm glad you called. I needed to talk to you, actually. Something's come up. Something that's... Harvey, listen to me. Stay away from the debate. What? No, Bruce, I I'm already here. Kinda crazy. Security's on high alert because of this threat from some guy named Penguin. They have me in some back room. If you ask me. Uh, look, Bruce, I didn't want to do this over the phone. 
but... My advisors are telling me that I need to... <clears throat> that I need to distance myself from you. Hmm. Until all this mess with your family blows over. I, I get it, it's the smart move, but let's talk about that later. I'm glad you see it that way. What with the allegations in the press, and now this mess with Falcone, you're a liability. But here's the thing, Bruce. Without your money, I am dead in the water. I know this is a delicate topic, but I need you to keep me afloat. I may have to trash you in public, but you and me, we all know the truth about our friendship. No matter what, we need a new mayor. Hill needs to be removed. And I knew you'd see it that way. Listen, I hate to push you, but I... Let's put two faith I in need this to know. mayor. Can I count on your money, Bruce? Whatever it takes to save Gotham. I'll always support you, Harvey. Oh, thank you, Bruce. Thank you. You don't know how much this means to me. To Gotham. I'm sorry, Bruce. The makeup person is here. <laughs> Guess she needs to put on my face. I hope you can still watch the debate somewhere. No matter what I have to say tonight, remember... You are always my friend. I'm a billionaire. I don't give a shit about a few hundred grand. Or however much he needs. It's gonna come by me... Gonna come back by me in the ass, isn't it? Just like my comment to Vicky Vale in the first episode. I was like, as soon as I did it, I was like, mm -hmm, I should not have done that. No, 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 no. And yeah, you should not have done that. Nope. Batman. Yeah, all quiet so far. I've got a feeling that's about to change. Yeah. Just so we're clear, you and me, we're on shaky ground. Why? No, so, listen to me. The excessive violence, it, it can't go on. Most what are you of the talking GCPD about? GCPD already think you're a monster. Don't prove them right. You're lucky I'm on your side. That may be true, but I can't ally with a violent thug. We have bigger things to worry about I don't about kill right people, now. I just punch them around. Your security has been compromised. I've got patrols on every door. You better check on them. Hello, I'd keep that voice. holstered if I were you. What's she doing here? She was part of that robbery at the mayor's office. Really? You're gonna drag out that dead horse? We're all on the same side, Jim. Uh, this better not come back to bite me. Uh, it Alpha always patrol. does. Come in. That, um, incident in the bar. Dead is its own kind of cage. I can't stand being in it. Not that I needed your help or anything, but you had my back. I thought I'd repay the favor. You know, like you scratch my back, I cut some people up. You don't owe me anything. Those scum had it coming. And they hmm. say chivalry is dead. None of my men on the ground are responding. Enough waiting. We're going in. Alpha, do you read? No, aren't you? You only have an here? alpha? The entire time he's like, Alpha, do so, for that. Alpha, beta, seta, delta, what? In there quietly. We are seriously underfunded at the GCPD. Sounds like a vote for Dent, Lieutenant. Dent? To put a dent in crime. Yeah, Jerry, I tried going down the comic book road. Um, it's a never-ending flow of water. It's a waterfall, actually. It's too much. It gives me gives me anxiety. There's too much out there, so I don't do it anymore. This is an important debate for these two candidates. Mayor Hamilton Hill and the challenger... I already don't have enough time to read all the books I want to read and watch all the films I want to watch and watch all the TV shows I want to watch and play all the video games I want to play. So, no. Comic books? Nope. Gave up on them. I'm going to take out these thugs. Right. Check one. Oh. Thanks, cat lady. Go, go, drone. 
Okay, I have to leave the house in an hour because Star Wars. At least we know why they weren't responding. Mm, they're, because they're unresponsive. We found your patrols. They've been terminated. Terminated. So they're not just unresponsive. Oh, great. As you might have guessed, there's been a change to tonight's program. First so, order of business. Firing the moderator. I hate to be a downer, but these hostages, I don't like their chances. Oh, they just didn't have a head for the issues. If we're quick and decisive, no one else has to die. If you say so. But Penguin's playing for keeps. Yeah, I say Fanatics so. Fanatics always do. <gasps> You'll do. Get out of here. Keep it quiet back there. These guys are armed to the teeth. Uh, we need a new moderator. Come on, you. You there. Yes. Yes. <gasps> Thank you for Thank the you for Please. No. Go on, then. Introduce the candidates. Stage fright, huh? All right, I'll get you started. But this is your show. Three hostiles. Gotta take them out quietly. Sounds good. Smash and crawl. Pound. Pound. Yeah, seriously. Trauma, trauma, trauma. Maybe next time. But we don't kill. Keep All good. Down. Make for the Hello. Police line. Okay, if you say so. Meep meep. And now a word from our sponsor. I tell my brothers and sisters of color. Who the fuck are you? You're supposed to be the scarecrow. End the masquerade. Who is it? Who is it? Did you ever meet the guy on the screen? Nope. Smart to let someone else do your dirty work. Who is that guy? Go on, love. You know what to do. Ah! <laughs> yeah, dent. Let out the dent. <gasps> the two faced dent. And Vicky Vale stabbed him. What's the best part, Jerry? Yeah, come on, tell us, Dent. Everybody in Gotham saw that moderator get shot on live TV. What's going on in there? Oh. First off, we should incinerate the pool. 
Ah. Yes, Batman always goes through vents. Now we're talking business, vent business. Now we're on. We're out of time, Batman. The brass is going nuts with those two drugs. You're fighting an uphill battle here, Jerry. I'm not reading comic books. No time. At the very bottom of my priority list, and my list is very long. Yeah, I'm going to a midnight screening here in London. Um, it's a double bill, so we watch The Force Awakens first, which starts at 9. And then we're going to watch The Last Jedi, which starts at midnight. Whoop, whoop. Excited. Supposed to be really good. Dad. I thought your father was dead. <gasps> Dad? Subject 9, Esther Cobblepot. You've been declared criminal oh, it's old. and committed to Arkham indefinitely. In oh, no. Please don't do this. So you had your chance. You should have made the deal we offered you. Give her the drug. Thomas, we were, we're friends. Our boys play together. You were warned, Esther. You know I always get what I want. Commence the procedure. Give procedure. Her the she won't come back from. Now you know. Now you will see. Maybe that was digitally altered. Who is this big guy? Is he supposed to be Bane or something? Who's the guy in the weird ass mask? And loading times. Go, go, go. Now I'll deal with you. Oh, douche face is back. <gasps> that was expensive. You go down, you douche nozzle. So nice for her. How about you kill anyone else? What, your turn, Dent? Bye bye, Hill. Corrupt fuck. Is he gonna be Bane? What's this monstrosity? That cannot be cannot be killed or taken out Where's in a non-lethal way. In your a Batman way. And you didn't even turn it up. Where have you been? Batman! The revolution's already started! It's too late to join! Let Dent go! And what if I do? I'll crush every bone in your body. I knew you'd say something like that. Turn into Two-Face? 
Mr. Dent. Selena can save herself, right? Oh shit. <gasps> she can't. Thanks. Freeze! I said freeze! Hold your fire, damn it! Where's the maniac in the mask? You commented, uh, that's the best part, and I was wondering what you meant, Jerry. Damn it, we let the penguin go. I actually Mayor read Hamilton The Watchmen. Was confirmed dead. While several members Pretty good of comic. The of, Arkham have been arrested, the penguin is still at of course large. the penguin is still at large. Yeah, I would have watched Force Awakens on Netflix today as well, but I get to watch it in the cinema, so no! No reason for me to watch it at home. On the cinema screen, in 3D, with other, other fans, yeah, baby. Meanwhile, the Wayne family scandal continued to escalate after the full list of Thomas Wayne's victims was released to the public. Okay, so we're basically fucking up our own family. Is he still turning into Two-Face? Maybe I should have saved Catwoman. He's lucky. It would have been much worse if the Batman hadn't been there. Yeah, much, much worse. There still will be scars. Yeah, so what? Scars can be sexy. Did you see her? Oh, I was wondering if you can... I can't yeah. remember how he turns into Two-Face. She kind of got far. So I'm wondering if you can maybe prevent him from turning into Two-Face. Lawyers representing Bruce Wayne have no comment at this time. We are the children of Arkham. Who are you? He reminds me of the Scarecrow, but he's not the Scarecrow. Oh, was that it? That was a really short episode. I thought they're usually like two hours, but this one was just an hour and fifteen. Interesting. Okay. Most people are not assholes and didn't let him suffer. Everyone tries to kiss Selena, because, yeah. When I say everyone, I mean the majority. Visit Mayor Hill as Batman. Uh, I wonder what would have happened in the other one. To fund Harvey's campaign, because you never know. Ah, okay, so most people save Selena. See, I'm wondering, like, usually that's what I would have done as well, because she's my partner in this. But I'm, I really wanted to see if you can spare him from becoming Two-Face. So, all right, let's see next time on Batman Telltale Series, so in episode three, let's see what's going to happen. Good to know that these episodes aren't even one and a half hours. Gives Next time, time on Batman, the Telltale series. There we go. Next time. Batman saved me. And I know this isn't over. Who are these people, Bruce? Authorities are scrambling. The so-called children of Arkham have the city in a frenzy. But there's still no sign of their masked leader. With Hill and Falcone dead by their hands, the question on everyone's lips is... Who's next? Hmm. After that news about your father sending innocent people to Arkham, sounds like the whole city wants your head on a pike. The Waynes have always run this company, but now... they want to decide what your future at this company will be. Hmm. He's way Do too good really looking for a penguin. you really think Bruce Wayne is worth protecting? Hmm. What do you want from me? You know what I want. Oh. No more hiding. I really should have said to her. 
But don't worry. Bruce Wayne's finally gonna get what's coming to him. Bruce! 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 Ah, uh, I wanna know who the dude is behind the, the mask now. Guess I have to wait for the next episode. Um, I'm probably gonna stream that sometime tomorrow. So thanks for watching, Jerry. Have fun with Star Wars. Don't post any spoilers or people will hate you. See you later.